The Steelers are at the line of scrimmage with a pair of backs split behind the quarterback. Roethlisberger is going to take it from the gun to the sideline and complete. Wilson's there that time for the tackle. First down at the 36. Airing it out. That ball has been picked off. The tackle was made. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did. They got the interception. The Falcons from the 37. Trying the right side. And he is tackled at the 44. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Second down, three to go. Getting away from the pressure. Got a big lane, and he's on the sidelines out of bounds. Nice awareness that time by the quarterback. Sometimes when you drop back, don't be too stubborn. Stand in that pocket and take a hit. If you have to run, take off. He gets it done that time and picks up a first down. First and ten. He's out of the pocket. Julio Jones with the grab. Jim, they got momentum on their side right now. They are making everything work. That was a nice play. They pick up another first down, and they got a good drive going here. Running away from the pressure. Throws to the right. Has his target. We're early in this game, but this defense must figure out a way to cover up this tight end because he's putting up big numbers. I don't know if they can stop him, Jim. It's so hard for defenses now to come up with ways to stop these tight ends. They look like power forwards of the NBA. They're big, they're strong, they're fast. What do you do? The Falcons call a timeout. Their first. Play number six coming up on this drive. Goal line defense on the field. He is in for the touchdown. How about that? The fullback scores the touchdown. He does all the blocking, gets beat up all the time, but nothing like getting the football where you can score to get it done. It's good. We've come to the end of the first half in the Olympic City of Atlanta. We'll take a quick break here for halftime before returning for the start of the third. This is the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's get ready now to take a look back at the first half. The Falcons are happy to be in front, and they'll look to play another solid half of football. The Steelers, on the other hand, want to quiet this crowd and turn things around. Smartly takes the knee in the end zone. The Steelers ready to take over the football. Bell takes his spot in the backfield. And now here's the first snap of the second half. And he gains maybe three. Coming up second down. Offense lines up here. Roethlisberger's back in shotgun formation. And he's taken down. That's what you call pressure. When everything around the quarterback, they're all at his feet. The offensive linemen are around him. He sees the arms of the defensive linemen all reaching for him. There's nothing he can do but fall to the ground. Third and forever. Good throw and good catch right on the sideline. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Hester's going to look for space now. And Gay's there to take him down. Falcons. 
Falcons are set now for their next possession. Offense lines up here. First down at the 34. Jackson, and a run right up the middle. That's a gain of seven. It's really been a spectacular showing by this tight end, Phil. It's been a really good day for the tight end, no doubt about it, Jim. Now everybody needs a franchise quarterback, a franchise wide receiver, and you would love to have a franchise tight end like we're watching here today. Three-step drop. Scrambling now. Ryan connects with White. White tackled down at the 36. In this league now, you've got to keep these wide receivers and quarterbacks guessing. You just can't come out there and play man-to-man -man every play and think that's going to work. You've got to mix in some zones, some blitzes, and then occasionally go man-to-man -man cover. This run goes nowhere. Stuff for a loss of four. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. The Falcons will take the snap from the 40. Now on the move. Throwing now to his left. Taylor's able to swat the pass away. Look up at that scoreboard. You're leading the football game, so we have a third and long situation. So you've got to know that. Manage the game. Don't take a chance. Nickel formation here for the defense. Ryan's now going to leave the pocket and tuck it under. And that's Allen who almost had the pick. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long. They can do just about anything, and it's going to work. And they stopped the offense that time. This will be a long one for three. No good. No good. They go for the long field goal try, and in the end, they come up empty. Yeah, they came up empty, Jim, and I, I thought it was a risk by the head coach. Uh, didn't manage the game very well that time. I would not have tried the long field goal. First down at the 47. Unable to bring it in. These receivers in the NFL, they are so good now. Anytime you see a drop pass, it's almost always the one reason they took their eyes off the football before it got there. Second and ten. Roblesberger, play action, and sailing out of bounds. It's third down coming up. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. And Holmes has got it, and a first. What a nice catch by the receiver. Getting past the yard markers, makes the catch, and gets a first down. Now first and ten. Antonio Brown with the catch. They knock him down, and he's still two yards short of the first. A lot of times you look at the drag route, and you think that's the safety bound. You know what? It is. The quarterback is always taught to look down the field. If there's nobody open, throw it to the drag route coming across the field. That time they did it, it's just short of getting the first down. Roethlisberger with the give. Wilson's all over the ball carrier. How about the defensive line? Getting that penetration, getting off the football at the snap, and getting it done, getting in the backfield and making that tackle. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Makes the catch, and he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Good job on the defense. Uh, they're well taught, well schooled by the defensive coordinator. They know in situations like this, if it's thrown short of the first down marker, they're good. They come up, make the tackle. Now we have fourth down. And he's tackled down at the 36-yard line. The Falcons are set for their next possession. Steven Jackson lined up in the backfield. Falcons snap it at the 36. Middle. That brings the play to an end. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it, 
and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. The Falcons take it from the 43, trying to power his way right up the middle. And the tackle is made at the 48-yard line. The third quarter comes to a close, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Split backfield here. The final quarter begins with this snap. Mitchell's the one who brings him to the ground. This will be second down. Matt Ryan under center. Jackson's hand at the football. The tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. That's an awesome job by the offense, picking up this first down here in the second half. They've got a big lead. It's not about scoring anymore. It's just about milking that clock, and that is an art, and this team is good at it. Offense lines up here. First down at the 36. He'll keep it on the play fake. Looking long to Julio Jones. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. It's not a good decision by the quarterback. I mean, maybe on the sidelines they keep calling the wrong plays, but he's attacking the strength of this cover two defense. Don't do that. Throw where they're not. That's deep down the middle. And now he'll take off. Has his man. Not able to get away from Taylor that time. Big and open. That's what this tight end's been today, Phil. Yeah, we see it more and more. Tight ends getting the football from their quarterbacks. Why? Because they're going against linebackers. They're faster and usually bigger than the linebackers. That's matchup you love on the field. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. You're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Now, the next snap from inside the red zone, where a week ago they starred as a team. Matt Ryan under center. Jackson's got it on the handoff. They are all over him, behind the line of scrimmage. And a loss of one. It'll be third down. Offense lines up here. Has his target. Offense lines up here. Looking to go up top again on first down. They're going to get him here for a sack. You got to be quick and decisive when you're down near the goal line and you throw the pass as a quarterback. That time he was not, and he takes a huge sack. This long drive continues. Keeps it here. Well, you got a lead to drive down the field to score a touchdown. Now we're going to find out if the other team can stay patient or will they panic. The Falcons for the extra point. And the point after is good. The Steelers are getting ready for the return. And can they return to a competitive state in this one as the game is starting to get out of hand? The score is 24 to 0. They'll take it at the 20. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Bell takes his spot on the backfield. Throws the pass. Roethlisberger sends it to Brown. He's tackled at the 30. Holding on to the timeout. He'll rush back to the line. And he's thrown to the ground. After being sacked on first down at second and 16. Now the offense in their hurry up. Roethlisberger standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Finds Brown. And they knock him down just a yard away from the first. Third and short following the completion. 
Roethlisberger set empty backfield. They send the tight end in motion. And that pass is going out of bounds. Incomplete. And the Steelers are ready to punt this one away. Touchback and the ball will be spotted at the 20. The Falcons are ready to take over now, and their offense heads on to the field. Matt Ryan under center. First down at the 20. Jackson's gonna take the handoff now. Falcons now move the chains. The Falcons have clearly enjoyed being able to take the air out of the football when needed today. Jackson's dominated on the ground. There is nothing like dominating a football game physically. They have overwhelmed the defense and a good job by the offensive coordinator managing this game today. First down at the 33. Matt Ryan with the long pass down the field. Almost intercepted. The defense did everything right in that situation. They were in the right spot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. Jackson's lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. And Gay's gonna make the tackle. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Gives it to Steven Jackson. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. The Falcons are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. Going for it on fourth down. The jumbo set on the field. Ryan gives it up. And bringing him down, it's Lawrence Timmons. Now they have a lot of courage to call these type of plays, don't you, Jim? And, and at that time, even though this team is winning, the coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Good play call, and they make it work. Double tight end formation. First down and 10. Play action fake. Looking to throw. And it's incomplete. I'd like to see this team throw the football down the field a little more often. That time, it doesn't result in a completion, but just keep trying. One more play, and it's in the books. Falcons have it at the 44. Gets away from the pressure. Going deep. Holds it in. What a goal and what a catch. This team off to a tremendous start, still without a loss. To be at this point of the season and still be undefeated, oh man, you got to be doing a lot of things well. Not only that, it just, it almost guarantees the fact that you, if you just play so-so, you're still going to qualify for the playoffs.